Welcome back to Let's Play Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne episode 34. Hopefully Hijiri, if I can ever get his right name, and don't mistake him for the other dude, Hikawa. See if he can point us in the right direction. Let's see. So that was absorbed by the Amala network, and well, he's probably fucking dead. <laughs> no shit, working alone gets me nowhere. Ooh! Gozu Tenno's back! Nice. Okay. Alright then. Oh, I knew it. You've got your own motives. You want to take control of the entire Amala network. Well, looks like we gotta head to. Fuck, um, it should be Ikebukuro. Keep forgetting where everything is now. It's been so long, because it has been a while since we did the last episode of Nocturne, because, well... I, uh, have such a strong distaste for this game that when I think about doing an episode for this series, I keep thinking, Oh, I can do literally anything else. So... Enough about that, though. Let's head to the top of the Mantra HQ, or what's left of it, if I can go the right fucking way and remember where my ass is from my head. And uh, avoid this shit. Then maybe we can get underway. You now I sometimes forget I have this shit. Alright, anyway. Down to the correct way. Through here. I've got the dreading suspicion that they're gonna have to make me go all the way back up there. Oh, all the way back up there. I'm not looking forward to that. Yeesh. Yeah, they are gonna make me go all the way up there. That's fine. That's fine. Would have liked if they had a shortcut or something. Maybe I can use this to go all the way up there. This is not what I expected, but I'll take it anyway. Elevator's an elevator, as far as I'm concerned. This is not the way to the- oh, this is the way to the elevator. Alright, I accidentally used a repulse bell and an attract bell. Let's see what that does to the system. Oh, they're gonna make me all the way. Okay. Alright, guess I'll skip ahead a little bit. Yet again. All right, finally, I'll head up to the 60th floor. Boy, I tell you, this meeting with Gozu Tenu better be fucking worth it. The last time I met him, he gave me two extra slots to carry demons in. I wonder what he's gonna give me now. It's probably gonna be a big old lollipop. Or maybe five dollars. Gozu, buddy, how you- oh. Well, you certainly looked better, but, uh... Not bad for- wait a minute. What the?! Oh, great. Oh, great! Fuck! <laughs> Oh great, Violet's gonna get the power of Gozu dead. Oh, and she's gonna get the power of Devil. Oh man. <sighs> okay. Alright. Okay. Uh, so he wasn't dead all this time then. He's just been sitting there just stewing as a corpse. Violet, I guess, shares that anger and wants to use the anger to get the power that she wants? Why does everybody gotta have their own reason? Can you not see the camera behind me? I'm the protagonist? Everyone should be following my reason. That's how RPGs are supposed to go, right? A kingdom ruled by strength. Okay, great. Okay, alright. So 
Oh, great. Yep. She is going to become the new devil. The new head honcho of the Mantra HQ. Leader of the demons! Why did I kind of expect that? So I've learned from working with the demons that... Even if I side with them, there's still gonna be plenty that are gonna come and kill me and- Oh, nice arm you got there. Ooh, really nice arm you got there. I'm just saying, even if I sided with the demons, even if I get a cool arm like that, it's still not gonna change the fact that I still gotta fight all these fucking demons in every ten steps. And what the hell? For a second, I thought I wound up in Mega Man. Well, Violet, love what you've done with the place. Uh huh. Uh, I'm looking. I can't help but look. But right. You got really spiky hair, though. How do you get your hair like that? Do you, like, use cement or something? Okay, you have the power to shape your destiny. Do you, can, can, do you, can you have the power to shape your arm into something a little less... Uh... Amorphous? I mean, it's kind of like a hand, I suppose, but... Oh, I, I guess I see it. I don't know. It just looks like it'd be hard to wear clothes with that thing. In my ideal world, is like, you know, a little bit civilized, but it looks like you just want to fucking kill everything. Cause I mean, you know, if that's what you think, more power to you, but... Okay, well... I guess I'm just... I'm just gonna ignore that! <laughs> I'm just, nothing to see here, okay, yep, that's just what happens, all right. <laughs> Time to go all the way back downstairs now. <laughs> they, they, didn't get, they didn't ask me any reason questions, they didn't give me any sort of power enhancement, she didn't, I don't think she even knew I was there. Wait, wait, she, she looked at me, but, d did she even really see me? I, was I even, where did she go? All right, um, I, um, I guess I'm heading back to the first floor. Maybe we gotta head this way. Yeah, you know, the Niskul gets the power of the Amala to achieve his goals. Violet gets the power of the devil, pretty much. And my teacher gets the motherfucking power of a powerful god of an artifact or something like that. I don't, I don't even know anymore. Where the fuck am I going? Oh, wait. How this works sometimes is that you just gotta talk to one random demon somewhere, like this guy. He's like, oh, there's something at Kabuki Cho claiming to be an emperor. Oh. So talking to this one guy, I now know where to go, otherwise I would've just been... <sighs> you mind are trying to tell the people something, I'm trying to get the plot moving a little bit, we need to be done with this fucking game, once and for all! Queen Mob leveled up! Good for you! Anyway, I need to get to a terminal. Alright. We're gonna take the Amala Link to, looks like, the Kabuki Cho Prison. Some guy here thinks he's hot shit. It's like, well, everyone thinks they're hot shit when everything's up for grabs. Does anyone know anything about working together? Friendship? Does that just immediately go, whoa? I do not remember it being this fucking foggy. I don't... Hmm. Well. Guess we better head to the top floor then. So where else would he be? Are we just fucking... 
Are we just like fucking backtracking now? Same old stuff to fight stronger versions of demons to pad things out even further. That's not fun. I mean, they put a fog filter. That's kind of interesting, I suppose. Um, and I guess it's still fresh because it's been months since I was last here. Luckily, getting up here isn't proving to be too difficult. For the time being. Well, not that way. But I am gonna save here. There's a guy who calls himself an emperor. This sounds like something worth saving about. Also looking ahead, I'm definitely going to need some sort of... let's see... Aha! Null death. That's what we're gonna be going with. Cause I know those secret about this guy, and really it's just saving me a headache or two. If only I knew where the fuck to go now. Um... It's blocked. I forgot how I got to the fourth floor. Guess I do have to jump down somewhere. Might as well be here. Is that right? I hope so. Turns out I was not. Well, okay, I'll do this anyway. For all the good that does, I guess. fourth floor. Maybe these are the stairs that we're meant to take. Yes, this is it. You know, a simple shortcut that loops back to the, the entrance would have gone so far good in my book. Just saying. Well, I guess I better save here again in case I get lost again. Alright, now let's take on this Emperor for real. I imagine something to do with the Jack Frost guys. Let's see. Let's take a look at this awesome, ominous pow. Oh my goodness. Well, I mean, if anybody wanted to assume themselves Emperor, that'd be a. Uh... Be a prime candidate, quite frankly. The Emperor of Kabukicho, huh? Well, it's time to dethrone you, I suppose. <laughs> My, uh, yeah, right, ho. I got a feeling that he'd still kick my ass even if I said yes. Whatever! Let's take my- oh, oh god. Well. This is gonna be easy then. I knew he was pro-death. Is that what Black Frost does? Well. Let's see how he feels with Mazandine. Not bad. Get going. Tornado. Ooh, nice. You, uh, let's see. Definitely not that. Um, just, just hit him. Okay. Yeah, don't do anything, but that's all right. But Mazio dying. Try that. Okay, you miss it. Sure. Sorry, avoided that too. Yeah, I've been, I've been busy training a lot of different Magatama. I think. If you want to call it being busy. What the hell? Alright, now you're just not playing fair. Come on. There you go. I'm gonna need you just, you know, up and die. Oh, come on! 
Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ah! Ah! Don't do that! It's stupid! Please, idiots do that! Gold Berserk over here. That was a that was the wrong move. Whatever. Do a full heal on everybody, will you? Thanks. Yeah, that's a little better. Oh no, we're not doing this shit. Definitely not doing that shit either. All right, let's do this right. Okay. Good. Um. A prayer, I guess. Yeah. All right. Now, do it up. Yeah, no, that's not gonna work. Nope. Doesn't fucking work. It's a good fucking thing, too. Oh, come on. You're, is such a big guy really so nimble? I mean, I don't... I don't deny it, but... It just seems a little unrealistic, this big doofus hee ho Running out of MP here, Garuda. Are you kidding? Well, you are just not hitting today, Garuda. What's going on, man? I'm afraid that doesn't sit very well with me. And you're taking the most damage from this ice, man. What, what am I supposed to do with that? Some, something we gotta give here. Mega damage there, one enemy. Well, let's see if this hits. All right, it's a little better. But you need to you need to work on that, okay? I don't like you missing all the fucking time. Yeah. You keep you keep that in mind, Garuda. I don't care if you're the highest level here. Well, except for me, of course, who uh, just gained yet another level. <laughs> yeah, let's go with uh, luck. I fucking need it. And I learn anti-death. But I'll just equip this thing if I really need to go with anti-death spells. Because I really hope that I don't see a whole lot of that coming up. Oh, you were just a regular Jack Frost! I don't buy it. <laughs> Hee-ho crap! Oh no, I've killed him. The snowman has went and melted. But I got Satan! <laughs> oh, what happens when a snowman gets the power of Satan? Well, you get Black Frost, I guess. Yeesh. What are the kind of stats on this guy? Because uh, Satan was one of the, uh... One of the Magatama I tried to get earlier. No death, weak expel. Huh. Kind of jive talk. Well, we'll see what Satan has to offer. See how on our side the lad is. And we'll take this time to heal everybody up. Alright, and we're good to go. Well, I guess the only thing to do now is to... Oop, wrong way. I guess the only thing to do now is to report back to Hijiri now that we've taken care of that... Kamaracho thingamabobber. Once I remember where the goddamn terminal is. I'm not good at dungeon crawlers. And here we are. Oh god, what is he doing now? Did he always have a purse? Have I noticed that before? Oh god, he tapped into the Amala. Oh boy. Everybody's fucking evil in this world. So Hikawa's going to the diet building. Oh. Violet has got the power of the devil. A temple with a whole bunch of Magatsui. Mannequins and Minafushiro, the crazy doll looking dudes and me 
Me? Ah. Is that what this is called? The Vortex World? Oh, oh, come on. Now my only guide, my only friend is turning on me. Not even me, come on! Do I gotta get the box out again where I explain that I create a new world? It's the... The what? Oh. Oh, the Niskel, right. What the fuck is going on? Oh boy. Well, that was a minor and sudden and shocking plot twist, I suppose. Now Hijiri is stuck in the Amala network. Will I go after him? I might as well, I suppose. What's the worst that could happen, right? I mean, it's not like it's been my first outing into the Amala network, right? What? What? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ah! That was one weird loading screen. I wish I could tell you, dude. Oh, yeah. Uh. Uh. I gotta pick one of them, but. Oh, well. Hmm. I don't know. I wanted to see how you were doing. Does that affect my reason or some shit? Because I sympathize one time with a guy who used to be my friend who's kind of looking a little bit like a beta Freddy Krueger right now? Um... The Disappeared. Great, thanks for everything, THE. Alright, well... So I better make my way back out, then. Oh, for God's sakes, not you again. Yeah, I don't look like a fart, dude. I'm not really quite like you. Alrighty. Oh, great. Well, hmm. Let's try this. Ha 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 ha! And then, let's do one of these! Heh <laughs> heh! Let's fucking think about that. And then, uh, well. Go with that, I suppose. There you go. You can hit him, it's okay. The thing about these guys is that they nullify or drain or void just about every single uh, magical power, so it has to be mostly fucking. Oh shit! It has to be um, mostly physical moves that you use. Okay. Well, whatever the hell that was. Let's do that thing again. That was fun the last time we did it. Maybe their death explosion will hit even less of us and they'll blow themselves up for fucking nothing. Let's do one of these again! Yeah, critical hit. That's what I like to see. Good. Ooh. Very good. Yep. Yep, pointed. Take scare two right there. Oh no. Don't do that. Haha. But do do that. I like this whole fog breath thing. That seems to be a good uh, good move for doing, especially if he's gonna be gathering new specters along the way. Do another berserk here. And heal everyone, because I think uh, Titania at least needs it. You just stare. Do that, I suppose. Oh, sure. Okay. Hmm. 
You're just blowing up your own dudes at this point. Oh, come on. Well, we'll get these guys at some point. It's only a matter of time, I suppose. Hmm. Alright, one more Berserk. We're cutting down their numbers little by little. We're down to four, and now we're down to one. But no, Titania is down to... Alright, now we're down to two. That's fair enough. Let's do another round of physical attacks. Almost got it, but I'm gonna need a bit of a heal for everyone. I need another turn for this. And then... Okay. Last resort. Okay, good. And I think we just auto the rest. Yeah. Whew. That went pretty well. Never we leveled up again. Great. Oh, this is good. This is good. All right. Look up again. <laughs> the luck is somehow helping. I have no idea how. The drive talk to get foul haunt and wilder. Get that out of here. Oh, Void Death, but again, we gave that up once before already. Give it up again. What's up, Queen Mab? A light ball, thanks. What's up, uh, Garuda? Ooh, a Chakra Pot, thanks. Oh, what, you don't have anything, Titania? Really? Well, fine. Alright. Well, I guess we'll get this cash cube for now. And I guess we'll. Oh, that seems like some place we should be at. Let's go. Oh, levitation and repel worn off. Okay, we'll turn that shit back on. That looks safe. It looks like a giant fan. Been here before, haven't we? I think we have. place is not familiar. We have not been here yet. Hmm. Oh, I can hear The's voice. What's up, The? Give me a break, man. I don't have the power to transport transport myself through the fucking Amala network like you can. Musubi, I guess, is the demon that he's using again? That's right. Come through the door. Yeah, about that. I'm gonna... go over here, maybe? Because I knew that I saw... a tr uh, terminal around here somewhere. Uh, somewhere around here. Hey, there we go. So I'm gonna save before we even think about dealing with your ass. And in fact, there is one thing I want to do before I sign off for now. Hopefully not for another month. I want to head to the Labyrinth of Amala. Because this entire time, we've been trying to do the true demon ending. That's why we've been doing all these ridiculously hard, nonsense bosses. And I do believe we do have enough candelabras to continue on to the next culpa. Which is what I want to do real quick. At least to open the way to the third culpa. That's the one thing I want to do before we end. Okay, there's another reason. I wanted to play this minigame again. Oh my god, it's so fun and they should have used more of it! Yes! This should have been what more of the game was. Minigames like this shit. Included in all the fucking trailers though, I bet it'd make it look more interesting than it actually is. Instead of the nightmarishly difficult- well, if you're playing a shimping on my Tensei game, that's what you expect, I suppose, is nightmarish difficulty, but come on! For real though? I 
How much did I get? How did three, four? All right. All right. Now I just need to remember my way through the culpa and get to the end of that. And well, who knows how long that shit'll take. But UDJ got lost in the terrible maze in the basement three of the second culpa and decided, fuck it, I'll do it later. See you next time.